Hello, it's Elder here, and today I wanted to go ahead and review this Groove Ring made by uh, Groove Life. Uh, basically, I've reviewed uh, tactical rings in the past, uh, something that I choose to wear, and I'll go into that a little bit later on why, uh, at least for my own personal reasons. Uh, but the reason why I also chose uh, this Groove Ring is because so far it's been uh, superior to uh, other products that I've used, that I've bought, and that I've reviewed. And uh, let me get into a little bit more detail uh, so that hopefully I could convey this information over to you and uh, you might find uh, that the groove ring will serve your purposes. So why one of these type of uh, silicone rings? Um, usually reviewing gear that has to do with survival and uh, survival applications and uh, you know things of that nature that are really going to help us in a physical way uh, during any type of uh, survival or uh, emergency preparedness type situation. Now, these uh, rings don't really offer much. Uh, I mean, I'm sure you could MacGyver something out down the line if you think about it, but you know, its primary purpose really isn't for a uh, physical application as much as it is for a mental application, at least uh, the way that I think about it and the way that I utilize it. And uh, let me explain a little bit more of the uh, why. So I've been married for a while and I do a lot of traveling, teaching the NTC method uh, around the world. And uh, recently, I'd say over the last year or so, uh, I was out in the Middle East and uh, had a couple of my students ask me, uh, or they were surprised that I wasn't married. And I explained to them, well, I am married and so on and so forth. And they were asking, oh, why don't you wear the ring? You know, and started asking all of these questions that I never even really thought about. Uh, and we're out there as teachers and uh, almost ambassadors also representing our country. And, uh, you know, little things like that that sometimes make a big difference, not really in our culture, maybe not in our thinking but uh, also in what we're projecting uh, while we're out there uh, representing. So basically wearing a uh, metal uh, wedding band was just not an option for me uh, with my lifestyle. Uh, too many injuries, I've seen too many people amputate uh, their own fingers, uh, whether it was in some kind of industrial job or uh, just military police uh, working out at the gym, you know, things of that nature. So of course I'm like, you know what, there's no way in hell that I'm gonna be wearing these uh, metal wedding bands. So I never did. And uh, then once again, from that previous story that I had told you, it got me thinking, uh, started doing some research and started picking up a bunch of these silicone type uh, tactical rings. And uh, that's what I wanna go over now, is explain to you what the differences are and uh, why I feel that this uh, groove ring that I'm actually wearing currently is uh, far superior to the other ones, at least in my eyes and for my needs. So I did a little bit of homework, uh, started researching who the better manufacturers were out there as far as these uh, silicone type rings, and uh, tried a few different ones. And actually the uh, Groove Life Company also uh, sent me a couple rings uh, from their competitors. <laughs> That's confidence, right? Uh, for me to do this review and do this review more accurately. So it was pretty cool that I got to try some of the other ones also that I hadn't tried in the past. And once again, it really just solidified uh, why I do prefer the, uh, the groove ring. So let's get into a, a bit more detail here. So I have a few samples here of uh, more of the better made uh, tackle rings and uh, you know companies that actually put some thought and effort uh, behind their uh, quality and uh, behind their product. So uh, here's uh, one that we have right here, okay, that uh, very well made, you know, pretty cool looking, an Enzo Men's Infinity silicone ring. Now, everything about this is pretty cool, the way that it's made, its design, so on and so forth. But if you look here on the inside, it's pretty flat. So for me, what it ends up doing is really just kind of choking out my fingers uh, because there's no breathability in there. Uh, just kind of goes on there, sticks there, especially when I'm active and I'm sweating or there's mud or so on and so forth. Stuff gets stuck in there, kind of suffocates my finger. Not a fan. Next here I have the, uh, the Quelo ring. Very cool packaging. Comes in this little uh, zipper packaging. And once again, a very good quality uh, ring. But once again, if we do look on the inside, it's just flat. And I already explained, at least for my needs and somebody that sweats a lot, uh, during uh, active lifestyles. That's the reason why we would even be wearing this ring. Uh, I don't know, there's uh, just once again, it makes me sweat, doesn't fit on there well. And uh, once again, why it's uh, not my top choice. Once again, good construction, but 
missing that extra feature that I was looking for. Next up we have the bullseye ring and this one I actually wore for months and I uh, was very happy with it because once again pretty good construction but if you do look on the inside it had all these little ribbings in it that allowed the air to flow and sweat and anything else so that it wouldn't get trapped in there and kind of end up choking out my finger. All right so that worked out really well so I was very happy uh, with the bull bullseye ring and thought that I found uh, the solution that I was looking for. But uh, what ended up happening was the more that I did use it, if you notice here, it began to stretch. All right, so just it just became annoying. Uh, let's say even swimming uh, laps in my pool or whatever, it felt like every third stroke, the ring would end up down here. So I was kind of incorporating this movement as I'm swimming into my stroke. Wasn't very effective. So as far as this uh, bullseye ring went, the features were there, the thought process was there, but unfortunately the uh, quality of the construction and the materials were not, or else it wouldn't stretch like this uh, over time. So I needed a new solution. I came across the uh, Groove Rings online, uh, saw their story, uh, small business, family owned, uh, you know, they, they seem like, uh, you know, the type of... Uh, guys and, and, and people that, uh, that I associate with, right? So it really reminded me a lot of, uh, of me and my lifestyle. Thought it was pretty cool. Saw how much passion they put into this Groove ring and I reached out to them. So uh, Groove Life went ahead and they sent me a couple rings of theirs so that I could go ahead and review. So I got this uh, thinner one that's actually for my wife and uh, she's quite happy with it. And I got one for me. So if you notice here, okay, we have the uh, quality construction, you know, good looking ring. It's not overbearing. It's a thinner profile. But what's cool is on the inside, you have all of these grooves that allow the airflow, allow the sweat to go through. So once again, my finger isn't uh, sitting there getting choked. I've also been using this for a while and it really hasn't uh, opened up for me. And I've really put it through the test with kettlebell work and fitness work and, and uh, combatives work, all sorts of different stuff. And of course, swimming. And uh, I am very impressed uh, with this groove ring. Uh, I had a feeling just because of uh, the way the company was addressing things and the support that they were giving me that they knew they had a superior product. But it's uh, pretty cool that I could actually go ahead and confirm that now and uh, made this groove life ring my go-to ring. So once again, if you're in the market for a solution like this for one of these rings, whether you're representing your spouse whether you're representing a memory anything like that i mean keep in mind that the survival game is a very big mental game and if i have something like this on me uh you know when things go awry and uh shortness of breath starts coming in so on and so forth it's pretty cool to look at this and know that i'm not alone out there i know it sounds pretty corny but it's the way my mind works and i think of my wife i think of my family and uh it bodes a lot better for that situation so this groove ring also has a lifetime warranty and all of the specs as usual, I will put into the blog post. So they, make sure you check that out. There's a lot of patent pending things that the groove ring has that uh, none of their competitors do out there. And I'll go ahead and lay out all of those specs so that you could go ahead and uh, read about it, learn about them and decide if uh, this is the ring and the right choice for you. So once again, if you are thinking about picking up one of these uh, silicone tactical type rings, uh, I've done the work for you. You know, now it's really up to you. I'm not saying that something better won't come along. I'm always uh, keeping my eye open, but so far so good. And as you could tell, I put a lot of stuff through the test here. So uh, just something else for you to think about, or maybe one of these other rings will uh, fit your need uh, better. All right. Once again, it depends. Everybody's uh, personal. They have their own personal opinion, their own personal preference. This one, as far as the groove ring happens to be mine. This is Helder. I hope that you enjoyed this review.